Hey guys, and welcome back to Worship Sessions. Every week at our uh, church, our day school has Wednesday Chapel. And as all the kids are home right now, we wanted to take an opportunity to lead you guys at home with your families in chapel worship. These will be some songs that are very familiar to your children, and I hope that you guys can gather around. And even though we're not in the same space, we'll still be able to unite our voices as we praise our Heavenly Father. Maybe your mama or your daddy, your brothers or sisters or whoever's at home with you right now. Bring them in and let them see some of the songs that we sing and some of the fun lessons we learn. So I know we'll be back together, but in the meantime, I hope that you will join me right here for chapel, okay? But I wanted to show y'all something and I want to talk to y'all about something. Do you ever feel like maybe you're alone? You feel like you don't have anything to protect you. You don't have anything to keep you safe. Uh, let me put it this way. When a fireman goes out to save uh, people from a fire, what do they put on? Their hat, their big coat, right? Keeps them safe. What about a policeman? When a policeman goes out to save people, does he make sure he has the right equipment and the right jacket? And doctors, they wear the gloves and masks. They put on what they need in order to be safe and protected, right? Well, we're kind of the same way. We can't do things on our own, can we? We have to have what? We have to have God helping us. And how do we do that? Every morning, we can put on the armor of God. 
we can put on his safety and we can remember him um, in everything that we do throughout the day to keep us safe and knowing that we are never ever alone. Okay, I have something to show y'all, but for that I need Mr. Michael. Okay, everybody's favorite, Mr. Michael. So, what do I have here? I have an orange, right? And what does Mr. Michael have? Glass of water. Now, we're gonna talk about if things sink or if they float. Okay, so let's for a minute pretend that this orange represents us. This is like us. That's kind of silly, but stay with me. This is us, and we're protected with the skin of the orange, right? So let's say that we are protected. We have the armor of God all around us. We have the shield of faith and righteousness, and we know that we are safe and protected. And whatever comes our way, we know that we will float. We are not going to sink. We are safe. God is protecting us always, right? Now, let's say, for example, that we took it all off. We think, we don't need all that. We can do things ourselves. Let's see if we are protected. Will it sink or will it float? Oh, uh, went all the way down to the bottom, right? Well, that's a good reminder that when we have on the armor of God, nothing can come in our way. We are always secure in His love. We are never alone, and we are never without safety. But when we try to do things alone, on our own, and without God's help, we simply cannot make it. All right? All right, let's pray. Dear God, thank you, Lord, for these children and for the families that they represent. Lord, I ask that you will continue to keep them safe and keep them healthy and help us to remember every morning to put on the full armor of God. It's in your son Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Bye, Bye. guys. Join us in singing, Lord, I Lift Your Name on High. We've been practicing this song for Easter and at chapel, so we hope that you'll sing along with us. coming days for another worship sessions. God bless you.